Surprisingly enough, where I live, large diameter pieces of bamboo are absolutely unavailable unless there's a tiki torch attached to the end of them. I don't want a tiki torch. I want a shishi odoshi, which translates literally from the Japanese as deer frightening device. So I'm going to throw away the tiki torch. Now I don't have very many deer in my landscape, but a shishi odoshi is a typical feature that you would find in a Japanese style landscape. And it consists of a bamboo pipe like this one, and it acts something like a teeter totter. It has a point in the center where we'll drill a hole through it and it rocks back and forth, making a loud clacking noise that reputedly frightens animals away from your Japanese landscape. All we need to do now is saw the end off. Now we've got this end cut to a bevel so that water can pour into it. It'll only fill to this deep though, because every place that there's a joint, you've got a solid piece of wood across it. The next step is to drill a hole through it so that we can insert another piece of bamboo to make our teeter-totter. Now with a hole drilled all the way through it, we take a smaller diameter piece of bamboo and put it through the tube. This becomes our fulcrum for our seesaw, so to speak. Next, we're going to attach it to two uprights with a piece of raffia, which will look fairly natural. You can use ordinary twine if you'd rather. And we need to do this part over by the water feature. Now, I've put these two slender pieces of bamboo in to support my seesaw, or teeter-totter the shishi odoshi, and I need to tie it on. And to be really official, I'm using kind of an organic twine. I'm using raffia. You could use string or anything else you'd like. The important part is to get the fulcrum horizontal, and that can be adjusted by moving one up and down like this, all right? The shishi odoshi must land on a rock. As water fills this end, it'll raise up, spill the water out, and fall back making a clacking noise to frighten the deer. I think it looks a little bit tacky with these things so long, so I'll cut them off. And then we go to the rock. Now over here, I've drilled a hole all the way through this rock and this bamboo stick. I've also drilled holes through the walls. I'm going to force it through the hole in the rock I've already connected my hose to the pump and the other end to the bamboo, and with any luck, we'll shoot water right into the shishi odoshi. The shishi odoshi is an ancient device that was used to frighten pests out of Japanese gardens. Nowadays, we have better ways of doing that, but still, this is a great way to lend a little Japanese flavor to your landscape and also to put motion and sound into your water garden. Into, in fact, your piece of the great outdoors.